Trisha Mandis and you are watching Take Control Tuesdays where you learn how to take control of your diet, your weight, and your health and today we are celebrating. So what are we celebrating you might be asking? Well if you didn't know I've been going to school abroad in Finland for the last two years. I've been working towards my master's degree in public health nutrition and I have a minor in sustainable development and I just handed in my thesis last week and just got the grade so I'm officially done with school. So huge, so awesome, I'm so excited and really especially right now I want to thank my friends, my family, my love, Cameron, thank you so much everyone for your support during this difficult time abroad. However, it has also been amazing. So I just finished my thesis, which is a very large research paper that you have to do. Mine was about 70 pages. So what did I research? What did I do? Well, I'm going to tell you because I think you're really going to like the results. So what did I do for my thesis? Well, I was looking for controlled trials of plant-based nutrition interventions. So what does that mean? I searched a database where scientific journals are published, it's called PubMed, and I was looking for studies where participants were put on a plant-based diet and those participants were compared to another group. That's called a controlled trial. So my search found six controlled trials where one group was put on a whole foods plant-based diet, the intervention group, and the other group was put on a different diet. So the control groups ranged from standard usual care from doctors, a your average low-fat diet, the National Cholesterol Education Program's Step 2 diet, as well as the American Diabetes Association Diabetes Diet and the Standard American Diet. So I was looking at studies on people who had heart disease, type 2 diabetes, or who were overweight. So what did I find? Well, one of the biggest findings I saw was that in five of these six studies, the whole foods plant-based eating group lost significantly more weight than the control group. So this word significantly is important because significance determines whether or not the results are highly likely to be true, meaning it wasn't some random fluke. It was really the diet that we can attribute the weight loss to. So again, five of these six studies, the whole foods plant-based group lost significantly more weight. So this is really awesome because even in all these whole food plant-based groups, there was no portion restriction and there was no calorie restriction or calorie counting. The plant-based eaters could eat until full satisfaction whenever they wanted, as long as they adhered to the prescribed diet and they still lost more weight which is awesome. The weight loss in these studies ranged from losing 23 pounds in one year to losing 13 pounds in 14 weeks. In the one study where the plant-based group didn't lose significantly more weight than the control, control group, that group was prescribed a calorie restrictive portion restrictive diet. So they were forced to eat smaller amounts of food and a lesser amount of calories and that was the American Diabetes Association's diabetes diet. However, the plant-based group did lose more weight, it just did not reach statistical significance. So these results are really exciting. So a whole foods plant-based diet was found to be highly effective for losing weight and you don't have to portion restrict or calorie restrict. So part of the reason that many of the researchers attribute the weight loss to is one, because whole plant foods are naturally really low in calories, especially compared to refined foods and animal foods, and they're naturally really low in fat. So you can actually eat the same quantity of food or even a greater amount of food, but you're still going to be consuming significantly less calories. At the same time, all plant foods, whole plant foods have fiber. So the fiber and the bulk of all this food is going to make you feel full. So when you feel full and satisfied, you're not going to eat for hours because if you do, it's going to hurt. So it's a natural regulating system that your body has in place when you're eating an abundance of whole plant foods. 
In addition to a whole foods plant-based diet being highly effective for weight loss, other results were also found. However, it is a 70-page report, so I'm not going to report all of the awesome findings right now. However, if you are interested in seeing my thesis, you can find the PDF document in the blog. Now I want to hear from you. It's time to hear your thoughts. I want you to take control now and answer this question and put your thoughts, your comments in the comment section below this video. Are you surprised to hear that this plant-based nutrition information, especially on weight loss, is evidence-based? Are you surprised that there's controlled trials that are published in scientific journals that document this information? Likewise, how do you feel that the Whole Foods plant-based group did better than a standard low-fat diet? That they did better than recommendations by usual care and doctors? And that the Whole Foods plant-based group did better than the National Cholesterol Education Program's diet? Because these are commonly prescribed diets. However, in the, in the studies, the Whole Food plant-based groups are doing better and you still don't have to count calories or portion restrict. I want to hear your thoughts on this topic, so please put a comment in the comment section below this video. And likewise, if you like this friend, show me some love. Click the thumbs up button on the top of the screen, the bottom of the screen, and let me know and everyone else know that you like this video. And likewise, if you really like it, please share it with your friends. There's social media links right below this video, right here. Just click that, email it to your friends. Likewise, tell them to sign up for email updates at trishamandis.com. They'll get free information so they can get started now taking control of their body and their health. Thanks so much for watching. I'm so excited to come back to the United States, be back in Oregon in just two weeks. Thanks so much for watching. Get educated, get support, and take control. Yes, you can get the healthy body you deserve. Yay, Trishy's coming home. Trishy's coming home soon. Yay. I want to give you a little heads up about education in Finland because a lot of people don't know this, but education is currently free in Finland. And no, you don't have to be a resident. It is, I believe, the only country in the world that offers free higher education anymore. So if you're interested in your master's degree, your PhD, check some schools out in Finland. See you next time.